Welcome, Alio. Thank you for tuning in to your horoscope for December 14th, 2023, on your channel, Zodiac Attraction. Discover what the future holds for you in terms of finances, lucky numbers, love, health, work, family, compatibility, and favorite color. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on daily updates. Get ready to explore your destiny. Let's get started. Hello Leo, how are you today? I hope this message finds your beautiful soul in good health. Right now, the cards suggest that it is a period to reflect on a relationship that may be raising doubts in your mind. The energy indicates that there is a perspective that needs to change, and you may be questioning whether that relationship is really giving you the results you crave. The presence of the Eight of Swords and Eight of Cups cards in a reverse position signals this evolving perspective. It is crucial to free yourself from uncertainty and confusion, and instead focus on commanding your energy and directing the course of your life toward what you truly desire. The reading highlights the importance of not becoming emotionally attached to a situation. There may be dissatisfaction and lack of appreciation in a relationship, which makes you feel out of your depth. The message is clear, it is time to let go and allow clarity to flow. It's not necessarily about ending the relationship, but rather looking at it with new eyes, recognizing energetic changes, and paying attention to what needs attention. The Ten of Swords and the Hermit cards indicate that it is crucial to recognize when it is time to let go of something. It does not necessarily imply the end of the relationship, but rather a pause to reflect and evaluate. It may be that the energy has changed, and it is essential to examine the situation, identify the areas that need attention, and direct more awareness towards them. The importance of setting limits and taking care of your own needs is highlighted. Giving more than you receive can breed resentment, and it's vital to take a step back to evaluate how you can give yourself more love and attention. The reading suggests that by honoring your own needs, you will find success, happiness, and joy in your life. The cards also indicate a strengthening of your abilities and sensitivities. This is the time to focus on spiritual and psychic development. By doing so, you will find the evolution you are looking for. Always remember to connect with your angels, ask for guidance, and maintain a conscious focus on your spiritual growth. You may feel as though your brain is firing on all cylinders, dear Leo, as Venus and Pluto square off in our skies. Obsessive thought patterns or excessive attention to details could derail your sense of balance, making it important to find ways to calm your body and mind while navigating tasks. Meanwhile, the moon continues its journey through Scorpio, aligning with the nodes of fate to help you maintain a positive outlook, even when life feels messy. Plan on slowing way down later tonight when the moon enters Sagittarius, asking you to embrace leisure before another Monday rolls in. You are full of imagination today. You may get a chance at workplace to visit places. You shall reveal your romantic self today. It is a day to let yourself free for a while. You also need to show your practical self at work. You also display a good mood to your peers. Check your mailbox. An important mail may be waiting for you. Stay aware of negative self-talk, Leo, and give yourself a hug instead. Today, the moon in your mental fourth house makes a sharp angle to shadowy Pluto in your self-care sector, underscoring the mind-body connection when it comes to your health. Minimize the stressors in your life and put your inner critic on timeout. Physical activity is a great antidote to anxiety, so get out of your head and move your body to restore balance. With the moon in your solar fourth all day, dear Leo, it's important to focus on strengthening your feelings of support and security, whether on inner or outer levels or perhaps both. Transits now are good for taking an objective look at matters. You might also see things more clearly if you verbalize or talk through an issue. You can come to satisfying and mutually beneficial agreements now. Conversations can be helpful. Focusing your attention on a special project can be useful. Your increased desire to find peace in your domestic life, family, and work can lead to agreements and favorable circumstances. 
Good energy is with you for solving problems and relating well with others. With Mercury turning retrograde in a few days and a new moon occurring in two days, finalizing decisions may not yet be wise, but you can enjoy the process of deciding now. In short, Leo, this is a time for self-reflection, setting healthy boundaries, and focusing on your spiritual growth. By following your path with confidence and honoring your own needs, you will find success and celebration in your connections and in life in general. Keep shining, Leo! Today's tarot reading for your sign. Five of Cups, reversed this card suggests that Leo may be overcoming a phase of loss or disappointment. The inverted position indicates that you are in the process of leaving these negative feelings behind. It is a reminder that although you may have faced challenges recently, the path to recovery and improvement has already begun. Knight of Swords, the presence of the Knight of Swords indicates a clear and determined focus today. It may represent the need to communicate clearly and approach situations honestly and firmly. This energy encourages you to face any conflict or challenge with courage and determination. Two of Wands, this card suggests that you are in a moment of decision-making and planning. It may be a good day to evaluate your long-term goals and consider new directions. The Two of Wands urges you to look to the future with confidence and take steps to achieve your goals. Taken together, the reading suggests that although you have experienced challenges, you are leaving negative emotions behind. Today is a day to approach situations with clarity and determination, harnessing the energy of the Knight of Swords. Additionally, the Two of Wands encourages you to plan your future and make decisions that bring you closer to your goals. Remember that the process of improvement has already begun, and this day gives you the opportunity to move forward with courage and focus. Now we will tell you how it will go with money and luck, but first remember to give us a like, subscribe to the channel and activate notifications, this helps us a lot and so you never miss your daily reading. Money and luck. Try to keep everything lighthearted, Leo. A more intense side to a work conversation could arise when Venus in Libra squares Pluto in Capricorn. You might be sharing your thoughts and feelings with a confidant when the tone suddenly changes. Something said could be considered an overstep or overshare. As a result, you may feel like the tension is palpable in conversation. If you do not want to get into a more serious discussion, then it might be best to sweep things under the rug. However, if you entertain a serious chat then you might be surprised where it goes. It can be challenging finding common ground but today encourages you to seek compromise moving forward with finances. This is a day of assessment and reflection, not a time to criticize yourself for any financial mishaps or troubles. Everything you go through makes you who you are, negative or positive. Take time to think of how things are panning out but also what small changes you can make in order to make things a little easier. Can you sacrifice some of the little things for the long term? Go inwards and meditate. Ask your inner being for help and advice. What is it telling you? The tarot gives you your lucky number. Your lucky numbers for December 14th are 30, 11, 4, 20, 8, 51. Daily love. Revenge could be on your mind today, Leo. The dark atmosphere of the day could feel like you're caught in a fatal attraction. This is because our sweet goddess planet, Venus, is clashing with a virulent Pluto in the heavens above. This is one of the most tragic and fatalistic planetary alignments possible, spelling out fear, insecurity, and wicked deeds. Tension may be simmering beneath the surface, triggering manipulation, jealousy, and vindictive temperaments. You can have a ferocious temper, so it would be wise not to jump to conclusions or engage in drama. You may end up regretting it for the rest of your life. The moon is in Scorpio and in your fourth house of communication, it is also squaring Pluto in your sixth house. This configuration is emphasizing the importance of tending to the day-to-day -day aspects that go into building a healthy and successful romantic partnership. 
While it is important to have a mental connection with your lover and have the ability to discuss different ideas and concepts with them, it is just as crucial to be invested in the more material and practical dimensions of your partnership, like dedicating a time of the day where you do something with your partner with total presence. Also, make sure that you are putting the energy and effort necessary into making your romantic relationships work. At work. Some sort of confusion is likely to occur at the career front today. You may be doing well enough in your chosen job. At the same time you may get an offer to join a business which is thoroughly trustworthy and offers a greater reward. Since you never saw the offer coming, this is likely to leave you in a state of indecision. Take your decision after long and careful consideration. Are you good at expressing your thoughts and ideas clearly? How skillful are you at communicating with others? How are you at advertising yourself? These are all pertinent questions to meditate on today as the moon is in Scorpio and in your fourth house of communication. It happens all the time, where someone has these amazing, brilliant ideas but they don't have the ability to translate them over to their audience. And because of that, they're never able to bring those ideas of theirs into the practical slash manifest world. Learn how you can refine your communication skills in order to improve your chances for success. The moon is also squaring Pluto in your sixth house, emphasizing that it's crucial to have the discipline and dedication to apply your great ideas into the manifest world and day-to-day -day life. Health. You have become used to a sedentary lifestyle and you have let your body go. The time is right to start exercising in earnest and regain the strength and stamina that you originally had because you may soon be called upon to perform a physically difficult activity. It is also necessary to relieve your stress. Unbeknownst to you, your unhealthy dietary pattern is actually contributing towards this stress. There is an increase in mental energy in the air today, Leo, enhancing your cognitive abilities and helping you feel more creative. This is a good day to pay attention to your thoughts and ideas, perhaps bringing a notebook with you to write them down as they occur. Yoga will bring balance to the body and the mind. Fluorite is a stone that promotes intuition, compassion, and concentration. Place a piece of fluorite on your altar and focus on its healing energy flowing over and throughout your body. For lunch, take a spinach tortilla and fill it with turkey, cheese, tomatoes, spinach, and mayonnaise, and then roll it and slice it for a portable, healthy treat. Family and friends. It is useless to drag a relationship for the sheer reason that you are in the relationship for a long time. Today you may feel low because of uncertainty and mental instability. Do not feel guilty. The relationship is not worth sticking to. Move on. Make up your mind today. You may move out of your relationship if you make yourself strong enough. Take things one step at a time, Leo, and see how they unfold in front of you because chances are they could go from 0 to 60 in a very short span of time. The intuitive moon is moving through Scorpio and your foundational fourth house of home and feelings, so you're in a rather restful mood. That energy gets a huge shock, however, when La Luna forms a harmonious and energizing trine to karmic Saturn in Pisces and your 8th house of love and intimacy. Compatibility. At work Virgo. In love Scorpion. In luck Capricorn. Your lucky color today. Light orange. We love that you get to this part of the video, don't forget to subscribe, like it and leave us your comments, at Zodiac Attraction we always read them and see you tomorrow, have a nice day.